So I don't know if you like seaweed when you're in the sea, but obviously it's tickling your feet. Obviously it's tickling my legs, my feet. Oh gosh, it feels absolutely so good. Oh, that's lovely. And the smell, oh, that is strong. Um, the only way I can sort of describe it is it's a bit cabbagey. <laughs> I mean, it's not, it's more earthy and more sea than cabbage, but I'm just trying to, trying to bring it alive for you. It's really, I love the fact that this is such a traditional thing to do, that it's something that farmers and the older generation do, and now you've got people in their 20s and 30s who are cottoning onto it. You're definitely quite close to nature when you're doing something like this. It's very real, very lovely. Oh. Oh. This is the cold shower bit to close the pores again afterwards. Oh. So apparently, Although in the 1900s, 1800s, whenever it was, my brain is freezing. When people used to rock up here on their horses, they couldn't leave with the pools open, so they had to get nice and cold before they went back outside. Well, I think we could say that this has uh, definitely sealed the memory of the seaweed bath into me, through every pore. Wow, that's amazing. If you've got any heart conditions, don't try this. <laughs> <laughs>